Yarn of Bees. It's me, Sandy. How are you today? Uh, today is another episode of Vlogist on the Cheap, where Sandy Duda from Left of Right Crochet and I give each other gifts all month long from the dollar store. Yes, and it's been great. I've been enjoying it quite a lot, and uh, I think Sandy has too. I think so. <laughs> so, ah. Oh. Gosh, it's uh, Sunday, and it's the Sunday, August 15th already. My God, I can't believe that it's like winter's coming. <laughs> so, um, yeah, so George and I are getting ready to go on our one-day, two-day fishing trip. Um, I went... <laughs> We went to uh, Mark's work, Wear World, today and got me some more um, rain pant things. Farmer Joe rain pant things. You'll see it in the video. Because <laughs> um, I ripped the butt out of my old ones. I used them for one day. Bent over to catch, grab a fish. Rip. <laughs> it was actually quite funny at the time uh but yeah that that's you know when you're wearing a men's extra large uh pair of pants like that and you rip the ass out of them you know you got a problem so yeah so i i got a bigger pair today and uh <clears throat> hopefully they'll work out just fine <laughs> I guess we'll see but uh and we got our fishing licenses today so yeah so now it's a matter of like we're washing uh our mac jackets and stuff like that to get ready and uh tomorrow i'm gonna start packing tia comes on tuesday to come take care of the animals yay and uh yeah so we're getting ready. I'm excited, but I'm also, I don't know, a, a part of me sits here and goes, God, I just want to get it over with so I can get back home. You know, that COVID has really messed with me. And I just, <clears throat> I just feel like I just want to be at home. It's too people-y. I just, I don't want to deal with anything. Uh, and, you know, it's just getting worse. So, yeah but hopefully once i get on the road and get out there um my anxieties will start to wane a little and we'll have a good time so yeah george is really looking forward to it he needs a vacation bad he's just work 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 and he's just he's tired he needs a break he'll never admit it but he needs a break <laughs> So, anyways, okay, let's get on with the, why are you guys like over there? I'm supposed to be like over here. Like, I don't know if that made a difference at all. Okay, you ready to find out what I got today? Here we go. Let's go over here. Oh. Oh. Okay, it's a very odd shaped box. <laughs> okay, crinkling. What in the heck is that? Oh, look at that! Plant these seeds to save the bees. Pollination kit that is so cool oh wow look it's a little pod oh that is so cool i didn't bring my glasses in i can't read it um i'm assuming that you just plant this right into the ground and the flowers pop up have you guys noticed that there is i don't know if, if it's the same down in the states but here in bc I am noticing a lot more bumblebees and a lot more dragonflies this year. 
um, which is wonderful. But uh, not as many butterflies, but lots of dragonflies this year. So that's cool, right? And uh, the bumblebees, the big black bumblebees, they're all over our front yard, right? And we've got this um, plant there that they just seem to love. So it's really nice to see because in the last couple of years, I haven't seen a lot of, of uh, honeybees and stuff. And I was really getting worried. So I am definitely going to plant this. We just got rid of our apple tree. We had them come and cut it down. And we had this other tree that uh, was just, it was being eaten by something. I don't know. It was terrible. And so we got that all cut down. It's amazing. When you cut just one tree down in your backyard, it opens up your yard like crazy. So <clears throat> next is going to be the blackberry bushes, getting rid of that. Um, we've got a palm tree out here that needs to be pruned. <sighs> but I'm going to do it in the fall when all the leaves are down and I can see what I'm cutting. And I'm, I, we just bought a hedge trimmer and I'm going to buzz it all out and uh, start over again. Because those blackberry bushes are crazy evasive. So, yeah, and then I'll find a little place to put this. That is so cool. Thank you so much, sweetie. That is so awesome. Save the bees. Yes, definitely. It's really sad when, when you don't see certain species of whatever around anymore. It's really sad. It really worries me. Oh, no, I'm not going to say what I was going to say. <laughs> I'm in a real mood today i was chatting up with a friend of mine about covid vaccinations and all that kind of stuff so i'm in a bit of a mood so i'm just not gonna let it get to me I'm not gonna let it get to me anyway okay thank you sweetie i love you and oh um i might have to pre-record the couple of days that i'm gonna be gone uh just so that it, I keep it going. <clears throat> and um, and then when I get back, I'll start up the actual recordings again. So, because <clears throat> I, I really want to focus on videoing the trip. Uh, so I don't have to worry. So, yeah. Okay, that's it. That's all I got. <laughs> okay, I will talk to you guys later. Love you. Bye.